Today we're going to be talking about grace notes. There are two types of grace notes that you'll come across in your music. Some of you already have. Those two types of grace notes are the achacatura and the appoggiatura. I'm going to be talking about the difference between those in a second. So why do we have grace notes? Grace notes are an ornamentation in our music that just makes our music a little bit more pretty. It gives it a little bit of character. So let's talk a chocatura. And a chocatura has a slash through the stem. That's how you'll know that that's an achacatura. The achacatura happens before the beat. Da-da, 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 da-da. The second type of grace note that you'll see is the appoggiatura. Now the appoggiatura does not have a slash through the stem, and that's how you notice that that's an appoggiatura. An appoggiatura happens on the beat. Da-da, 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 da-da. Now a former student of mine told me that they're playing a piece called Carrick Fergus in their band, and I checked it out online, it's a beautiful piece. It has a flute solo in it, as well as a couple of other solos. And the flute part has six measures of a chocatura and a pagiatura. And so this is a prime example of applying these in our music. So up on the board here, I have an excerpt from that. It's measure 31. And I'm going to go ahead and take these out of context, and then go ahead and put them into context so that you can hear the difference between them and apply them to your music. So out of context, let's go ahead and take a look at our first measure. That's going to be an achacatura because it has a slash through the stem right there. So that sounds like this. All right, and then our second measure has an appoggiatura, which is on the beat, and that sounds like this. And then our final measure is an achacatura. All right, so that's out of context. Now what we're going to do is put that into context. I transpose this for alto saxophone, so if you play flute and you have this in your part, you can go ahead and play along and we'll be in the same key. All right. Here we go. Measure 31. One, two, three, four, one. that so we can have another go at it. Um, so anyway, that's the difference between two types of grace notes that we're going to come across in our music. The achacatura, which has a slash through the stem, and that's how you can notice that that's an achacatura. That happens before the beat. And then the appoggiatura, which has no slash through it, which will happen on the beat. So I hope that clears up the difference between those and how to apply it in your music and what it'll sound like. Thanks for watching, guys.